My grandfather was the great-grandson of Queen Victoria, and he claimed to have knocked the spectacles off the end of her nose while she held him at his christening. And clearly emboldened by this, he went on to become the last Viceroy of India. I was the last grandchild, hence my name. My mother also led an extraordinary life. She had a front row seat at many historical events, and she served as a lady-in-waiting to the Queen, and also as a bridesmaid. And many years later, I was invited to be a bridesmaid at Prince Charles and Lady Diana's wedding. My father, David Hicks, was arguably the most influential designer of his generation. He designed everything around him, from the bowling alley of the White House to the nose of a client. I grew up in the Oxfordshire countryside in England. I went to school in the freezing north of Scotland. I studied in Boston and I modelled in Paris. And I've lived in New York, but somewhere along the line I stumbled upon Harbour Island, an out island in the Bahamas, where I met and fell in love with a man and a gentler way of life. We created a home and we raised five children. Feeling that I was born under the luckiest of stars, I wanted to share part of my life, a little bit of my British heritage, and a lot of my island story. So I've created a line of the highest quality gifts, accessories, and bath and beauty products, infused with, I hope, that adventurous sense of spirit. But more than that, I want to create a more meaningful shopping experience, somewhere that women can gather together and share their own stories. I also wanted to provide the opportunity for women to be at the centre of their own business, headquartered from their own home, and on their own terms. I want to create a force of entrepreneurial trailblazers. I'm therefore really excited to be launching a lifestyle brand directly into the heart of the home, defying the traditional shopping experience, and selling my collections through networks of extraordinary and individual women. I invite you to take your life from ordinary to extraordinary.
Having been the daughter of a very great designer and having grown up with design all around me, there was something that was somewhat suffocating when I was in England and I had that brilliance um, everywhere. And so I, I left that world and I traveled and I became a model and I worked with teams of people who I would never otherwise have met and I loved it. But it is extraordinary to me that 18 years after leaving a very traditional upbringing, I find myself here on this tiny little island in the middle of nowhere. I fell in love with the island and a man and we have somehow created a life and a family here. When I came to the island, I suddenly realized that I could come out from the shadow of my father and I could stand on my own two feet and I could design things for me, for the world that I'd started to create. One of the most exciting things for me right now is that I have brought to life collections, lifestyle collections, accessories, bags, scarves, beauty, and all of it has my heart and soul poured into it. It's well designed, they are beautifully fabricated, they're of an extremely high quality, and I stand behind everything. We're a company dedicated to empowering women and helping others to do the same by living an extraordinary life. We do this by gathering together and sharing collections of beautiful products. Take advantage of this ground floor up opportunity to enable you to live the life that you've only ever dreamed of. In the same way that I now recognize that I can stand on my own two feet as a designer, as a woman, as a mother, as an entrepreneur, I want you to do that too. I want you to harness your talents, to find the best in you, to develop your skills. We're gonna give you the tools to do that. Come and join my extended family. There's always a seat for you here at my table and we're gonna do extraordinary things together. To learn more about me and my collection, have a look around indiahicks.com.